Welcome to the Launchpad Inbox Overview video. Launchpad is a web-based diagnostic information access application for healthcare providers. In this video, I'm going to go over the information that is displayed in the inbox and show you the different functions that are available. The Launchpad homepage is the Launchpad login screen. Enter your user ID and password to log in. Once you have logged in, you arrive at the inbox. This is where new reports are displayed. From the inbox, you can view and print these new reports. Once the reports have been printed, these reports will then clear daily at midnight. If Launchpad is the only method of report delivery, you must manage your inbox by printing the reports on a regular basis. If Launchpad is not your primary method of report delivery, such as you also receive reports in hard copy or via an EMR, the oldest reports will automatically clear from your inbox once it reaches the maximum threshold of 1,000 reports or three months. Reports that are clear from the inbox are archived in patient summary and can be retrieved by using patient search to search for the patient's record. We have a list of new reports that have not been actioned. The inbox count in the bottom right-hand corner indicates the number of reports in the inbox. Each line represents one report. The date in the first column is the collection date of the specimen or exam date. Then the next column displays the patient's name. Under section is a list of section of tests in the report. Then in the reported column is the name of the reporting facility. You can hover over the reporting facility to see the full name as well as the telephone number for the facility's results center. Status indicates the status of the report. You can also hover over the status to see what the status means. An F status indicates that this is the final report. Then in the last column labeled PRT is the print status column. The print status will update when you have printed or viewed the report. One other item to note are these sections that are highlighted in pink. The pink color indicates that there are results out of reference range and the results have been flagged. From the inbox, you can click directly on the section description to open a single report, or click on View to view reports in a series. In this workspace, you can use the arrows to navigate to the next or previous report, and you can also print the report from this view. Once you are finished viewing, click Close to return to the inbox. After viewing the reports, an icon that looks like a piece of paper now appears in the Print Status column. This is to indicate that the report was viewed. If the report was printed, you will see a printer icon instead. You can print reports by selecting the different print options. You can print all to print all reports in the inbox. All final will print only reports in final status. Selection will print only reports you have selected to print. Multi-patient report will print a report for a selected test for all patients within the inbox. Print summary page only will print a list of current reports in the inbox and reprint gives you the option to reprint from the last five batches of print jobs. By selecting print all final, I have printed all the reports with a final status and a printer icon now appears next to these reports. These printed reports will clear from the inbox view at midnight. It is important to note that viewing reports do not clear the reports from the inbox. You can use the filter function to apply filters to the inbox reports and you can use the status function to change the viewed or printed status of the reports in the inbox. You can also click directly on the patient's name and it will take you to the patient's summary to view historical patient reports. There are different tabs for the different types of content. The historical reports are listed in order of newest reports at the top and is set to display reports from the last five visits. Use the result filter selection by date or by test information to change the reports being displayed. In patient summary view, use the view and print buttons to view or print patient reports. Click on search to perform a new patient search. You can search using a patient's health card number or the patient's first and last name. Once the search result return, click on the patient's name to access patient summary. To return to the inbox, click on inbox. This completes the Launchpad inbox overview video. Thank you for watching.